stream for streams? Do you see stream? Chat, I need to make sure that everybody can hear me. Um, hold on, let me handle a text right here. I just got a text. Okay. Hello, everybody. Good, you can hear me. Things are working. This is my first solo stream. Uh, I'm sure everything will go horribly wrong, and it will be horribly boring, and uh, yeah. Yeah, but you know what? Whatever. Whatever, I'm here. I'm trying. If you guys can't appreciate that, well, fuck you, all right? Fuck you all. Fuck you all to death. You're all terrible people. That's what I always say when I'm not streaming. I mean, you're all great. You're all just wonderful. Okay. <clears throat> Actually, kind of waiting to find out if Jack is going to Skype in for a bit. Um, can if he wants to, but uh, I don't know if that's gonna happen. I don't know if that's gonna happen. I guess I guess I'll start the game, and if he wants to get back to me, he can he can get back to me. This is the game. Mother motherfucking thief, thief the dark project. I know, I know your poll wanted Jedi Knight or XCOM, but uh, I'll tell you what. We'll play a little bit of Thief, and then maybe, maybe afterwards we'll do some uh, either XCOM or Jedi Knight too. Okay. All right. Um, how is the volume on the game? Is it overpowering? Actually, you know what? Oh God, I'm not used to doing these things. Let me see. Oh wait, actually, I can't. Jack's the one who's logged into the previously recorded account. Um. Jack, if you're listening to this, if you could change the title to say, uh, Thief, that'd be great. That'd be great. Okay. New game. Start training, because, yeah, why not? Why not? It's fine. I absolutely love these flavor texts. <laughs> I was a kid. No parents, no home. Running messages and picking pockets to keep my ribs from meeting my spine. One night I saw a man. Folks just passed him by like he wasn't there. I thought he must have something valuable, so I snuck up on him and made a grab. <sighs> That's not for you. Please, sir, I'm hungry. Don't tell the hammers, I promise. What is your name, boy? Garrett. You have talent, lad. Let go of me, old man! To see a keeper is not an easy thing. Especially one who does not wish to be seen. We have a need for those as gifted as yourself. If you've grown tired of how you live, then follow me, and we will show you a different way. Leave me alone! As you wish. I caught up with him just before he vanished into the crowd. It was the beginning of a very long education. Okay, for one, I'm not skipping the goddamn cutscenes. I love this game too much. And, and for seconds, I'm not talking over that because I want you to hear this thing. Garrett is like my, my favorite character in, in all of video games. Uh, if you can't appreciate that, eh. And besides, I warned you guys, I'm, I'm playing alone here, so there's probably going to be some uh, relative quiet on me. I'm going to alt-tab out of here real quick, though, to do something real quick. Kind of just monitoring the stream and my stream on Twitch is not loading, so I'm re refreshing that right now. Hopefully the video will pop up. And I'm assuming you're seeing the video of the game. I'm assuming that's all working. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm not skipping anything. I'm, I'm reading some of this chat now. I'm not skipping jack shit.
Jack can, Jack can call in if he wants, but he doesn't have the internet right now. It's probably not the easiest thing in the world. I don't know if he wants to... eat up phone minutes or whatever. I don't know what the fuck's going on in his end with phoning and Skyping, but... Eh. Is what it is. Alright, back to the game. This is just the tutorial. But we're playing an expert on the tutorial. Welcome, young Garrett. In the nearby rooms, I will instruct you in the various skills you will need to survive. Please stay in the entrance area to each room while I explain the room's purpose. When you are ready to begin your lessons, proceed down this hallway to the first room. How, how would I rate this game? Uh, well, this is probably in the competition for my favorite game of all time, so I rate it very highly. What did I, what did I set to run here? Key binding, let's jump. That's also jump. Alright, let me fix that. Controls, customize controls. Because, you know, this is a PC, we can customize the fuck out of everything. Alright, that's jump, so run is going to be... Oh, that's... What is that? What else does that bone do? I do a stupid. Might have. Oh, you know what? I probably did. Well, that should work. And we're in key. It's not working. It's just making me stop. Oh, it's because I'm trying to... Okay, you can't hold down the run key and walk. The run key is separate. It's been a long time since I've played this, so... You must learn how to move unseen. Stay in the shadows. Avoid the light. The indicator on your screen will tell you how visible you are. Try to reach the top of the platform without being seen. It's easy to stay in the shadows. Which I could probably run while I do this. You don't have to. Alright. See, this game, um... Uh, sound isn't very, very important. Uh... Stone well here, done. You... I did not see you approach. Open this door to continue. When the door is near the center of your screen, it will light up, indicating that it is selected. To manipulate selected doors and other objects, use them. Good. Proceed down this corridor for your next test. Now you must learn to move quietly. Some surfaces are louder than others when walked upon, and moving quickly makes more noise than moving slowly. Listen to your own footsteps to hear how much noise you are making. The instructor will have his back turned. You must get to the top of the platform without being heard. Uh, this game is also... its on, I believe it's on Steam, but it's also on uh, GOG, which is uh, the copy I'm currently playing right now. That's, that's where I got it from. Uh, it just makes it easier to install because GOG, once they release a game, they, they tweak it so it'll run on modern systems. Gonna slowly walk up these stairs, can't make a noise, pass tutorial. Very good. I did not hear you traverse the room. Right. Beyond this door is a hallway that will lead you to your next task. Now get your weapons. To pick up objects, select them by centering them on screen until they light up. Then use them. Choose your weapon now. Try readying your sword, and then your bow. You can always put them away again if you need your hands free. Now let's go out to the courtyard for some target practice. Ready your bow. 
Knock an arrow and draw back the string by holding down the attack button. Make sure you draw all the way back, or your shot will not have full power. Take aim, and when you are ready to shoot, release your attack. See if you can hit one of these targets. Good shot. Keep practicing if you wish. When you are ready to proceed, approach the training dummy and ready your sword. I'm still a pretty good shot. Swing at the target with the attack button. A quick tap will give you a slash. Move the tip of your sword to the left of the target for a left slash, and to the right of the target for a right slash. Hold the attack button down, then release for an overhead swing. Try both slashes and the overhead swing on the practice dummy. Good job. You're ready for a live opponent. To practice against your partner, enter the cobbled sparring area. You're complaining, I warned you this would be a quiet stream. Keep sparring if you wish. When you are done, leave the sparring area. <laughs> he dodged that one, that fucker. Get out of my circle! I'm going, I'm going ape shit on him! Ah! Miss! Oh no, he's fighting back! He's fighting back! That's enough sparring for today. Please walk over to the table. <laughs> Would you care for some refreshment oh. before we move on, young Garrett? Please pick up all of the items on this table. Now, if you didn't Cycle notice... through your inventory to see the objects you have in your pockets. Once, Once you started that sparring match, you may use none it. of those items were the ta on the table. Wish. Then you may proceed. The Ga next test is waiting on the other side of the metal door. Shut up, tutorial man. Uh, the story of this... Well, you, you watch the intro bit. The door you're, is locked. You're, but the key from the table will open. Shut up, intro man. The door, select the key in your inventory. Oh, no. Center the door on screen until it lights up. Then use the key on the door. Good. Now head down this hallway to get to your next test. And you're basically trained from a relatively young age by a a, a group of uh they're basically the keepers are are stealth monks. You're basically a stealth monk. Now you will learn new movement skills. First, climb the rope by jumping onto it. They have some kind of weird ideas about balance and detachment and... that kind of takes Move the Move while looking up or down to climb up or down, down the rope. Turn to change your facing. If you jump again, you will release the rope. Now climb the rope to what get to the, the top fuck? of the platform. Ooh, we have a subscriber. Somebody subscribe for this shit? The other side of the stream. Mean Mr. Mustard! Thank you for subscribing. Okay, that was my jump key. Just making sure before I fuck up this jump. Alright. Good jump. <laughs> good jump! I did good, I jumped. This obstacle is easy to climb if you know how. First, move close to the wall. Next, jump to grab the edge of the wall and pull yourself up. Good job. Yeah, I already did it. Shut up. pleased with your progress. You have passed the last test for today. If you wish, you may stay to practice your climbing and jumping, or swimming, ducking, leaning, or crawling. When you are finished, the keepers you may return to your chambers by them. going through that red door. But I found other well. uses for those skills. All right, that was the training mission. Easiest buy. Easiest buy. Oh my god, I dropped my mouse. My cordless mouse fell off of my my little mousing platform here. All right, that was that was the tutorial, and I'm loving this. You guys probably bored in tears, but I don't care. I don't give a fuck. This is thief. All right, I'm going to continue on. I love these cutscenes. They're like moving paintings. What the fuck? Waffle Tail, thank you for subscribing. 
for this shit. What the fuck? Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> Dave AA005, thank you for subscribing. Hero Games, thank you for subscribing. We really appreciate it. I can't believe you're subscribing for this. Me alone playing a 20 year old game. Well, it's not 20 years old. Is it? Might be. Jesus Christ, I'm a fucking old man. Nearly. I think it was 97 or 98. I have a simple job planned for this evening. Break into a guarded mansion, steal another fat nobleman's priceless trinket, and leave quietly. Lord Bafford is out of town, and rumor has it that the captain of his house guard went with him as a bodyguard. The time is ripe for a bit of burglary. The front gate of Lord Bafford's manor is always guarded, and the main street is far too exposed. But Cuddy tells me there's a better way in. Around to the side, more out of the way. One guard, and likely no witnesses to complicate matters. The piece Cuddy wants is a scepter. Silver, jewels, the usual adornments. It should command a high price. Bafford, like most of his kind, probably keeps his treasures on the what top the floor fuck? of the place. Close to his heart, and far from his servants. No point in waiting. I have Cuddy's old sketches of the place, and everyone who's going to be asleep inside already is. It's time to begin. Nine Reads One. Thank you for subscribing. We really appreciate it. I didn't want to interrupt the cutscene with that thanks. You know, because these cutscenes are great, and you should watch cutscenes. So, subtitles, please? Um, does Thief even have? Subtitles? This game might not have it. I'll check in a second. Hold on. Alright, expert difficulty. That's that's good. That's what we want. We're loading up yonder game. Now, in between missions here, you get to buy items. Um, I, I don't, I'm not going to need any of this shit. I'm going to buy I'm gonna buy just because. You lose money, too, if you don't use it. So, like, this 300 cash. Basically, you're, the money you make in one mission carries over into the next, but it doesn't carry on past that. So anything you don't spend between the missions, you lose. So... Ka-ching! Ka-ching! I love it! Oh, what? Can I not afford that? How much money do I have in that kitty here? Oh, they cost 250. Oh, well, never mind. No, no health potions. I'm not, I'm not gonna need them. Not gonna need them. Actually, I'm playing on Expert. I don't know if you're paying any attention to the difficulty constraints on Expert. You cannot kill. So if I get caught, my only real option is to run away. Because you're not allowed to kill the guards. Here we go. I'm gonna ease- I'm gonna ease drip drop in on this conversation because I get great joy from this. Hey, I'm going to the bear pit tomorrow. You wanna come with? <laughs> Couldn't pay me enough. What? You soft belly. The bears have got these new muzzles with underslung cheek spikes. <laughs> Last time I was there, there was a real eye gouge. <laughs> nah, nah. It makes me sick. When I was a kid. Huh. Surprise you're even in this job. Oh, the blood it just turns my poor tummy. Shut up, you taffa. You want blood? You should have been there years ago. Tell you. The bears then. They were something to see. Those bears, they didn't need no cheek spikes and razor collars and paw hooks and all that knifery you straps to them now. No paw hooks? Oh. What'd they do? Never seen that happen before. Bump into each other? Huh. Nah. The bears back then, oh, they had claws as long as your finger and wicked teeth. Bears, you're topping me. They look pretty mangy harmless, long as they're not wearing harness. That's why I can't stand the pits now. You don't know what you've missed. 
They just don't make bears like they used to. Whoa! Killer bears. Would have liked to see that. <clears throat> don't make bears like they used to! Which way am I going? I'm going this way. I've never seen a, 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 one of those servant guys walk through that door before. I've, I've played this game a lot back in the day. I have never seen that happen. My mind is blown right now. Alright. Anything down here? Jumping in the sewer. For, for no... Oh, no. I, I lost some health because I jumped down rather than climb down. Because stupid. Stupid. Anything we learn from Invisible Ink, it's close the door. Always close the door. That's been... I'm going to say six years or more since I've played this. I don't remember if there's... If there's loot to be found down here. If there isn't, I'm I'm wadding through sewage for absolutely no reason. Other no, no, no loot. No loot. Oh, this this may have been a a needless side trip. I thought there was something floating around down here. Damn it. Thing in here. Floating debris. Oh, exciting. This is sad. I'm wading through raw sewage here because I'm looking for coins. Oh, god damn it! God damn it! Nothing. Nothing. All right. Noise is very important in this game. Um, it's always smart to listen before you go through a door. There might be a guard. This guy here. Look at this. He's drunk. I'm gonna steal his key. Key's mine now, pal. Key is mine. I could use it to open this door. I'm gonna lock it behind me. There we go. Alright. There we go! Oh god. Alright, which way is it? I'm not gonna knock him out, I don't have to. I like to I like to to uh ghost this game. I basically I, as little interaction as I can. If I can get an in and out without alert any alerting anybody or knocking anybody out I'm happy I'm very happy if I could pull that off oh spiders all right Come on climb out why are you not climbing jerk There we go. <laughs> Shit. They see me. They see me. Jumping back in the water. Let me get my... There we go. That's not good. They all see me. I can't get out of here. This is terrible. <sighs> Missed! Oh, I hate spiders.
This is not going well. This is not going well. This is a joke. Uh, that that was clumsy and awkward, and I hate myself for that. That was so graceless. Since I'm in here, I might as well pick up something for myself. All right, we're we're back off to look for the entrance to the mansion, the underground entrance ent entrance. Mansion entrance? Whatever. I can't talk. You know that. Anybody who knows Rich Evans knows he can't talk. God, he does not want to get out of water today. There we go. All right. Inside at last. I've been thinking. The circuit really beef up security, so. What do you mean? What's wrong with us? Well, we're fine. But I've been thinking we should watch the outsides more. That's stupid. People to worry about, they're on the inside. No, then you catch them before they get inside, you taffer. Oh! Hear that? You hear that that loud noise that happened? That means there's a grate here somewhere. So I gotta pay attention to the ground. I don't wanna walk over that. Because he'll turn around and see me. See right here. Right here. It's a trap. It's a trap, I tells you. Right. Is there anything to steal in this area? I don't remember. I don't think so. No, I'm gonna say no. Wasting, Wasting valuable time. Alright. Fortunately, he's standing right there, so I need to distract him. What I'm gonna do. Is, see the shovel here I just picked up. You know that. You remember that noisy grate? Come out, you. He's gonna go investigate that, and I'm gonna sneak around his ass. I'll find you. Just you wait. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Not found much use loot yet. Um, might be a problem. Mine. You need, on expert difficulty, you need to find so much more money before it'll let you go on to the next level. Money in there. And there's just a useless face in there. Set that down gently so as not to make noise. Alright. Moving on.
I'm not just gonna blackjack everyone. That is the most boring way to play this game. It's the easiest way to play this game, but it's boring. Do you have any loot? A hope chest or something? No, you don't. Well, you're useless, aren't you? That's awkward. They're just they're just standing there. In in this room. That's it, they're just standing there. Eh. Don't wanna walk past that door. They're not asleep. This game is scarier than Five Nights at Freddy's. Anything's for anything anything is scarier than Five Nights at Freddy's, but for another thing, I haven't really gotten any of the scary parts in this game. So far, I'm just doing the... ...pure mansion heist type stuff. I don't think this is where I want. There's the thing, if you actually lean up against the door, you hear better what's on the other side. Mm -hmm. And there's somebody in there walking around. And we're gonna find another one. I don't like that. I don't know if you're talking about a different game, but you do not have to blackjack all the guards. I find this game more enjoyable when you don't. The, the art of stealth is getting by unnoticed. Oh, those jerks. See if we can get to some excitement. This is exciting. What she got. Shadow there. Oh, not to see here. Never mind. There's no one. What here. the fuck? Oh, uh, sharp fourteen fourteen. Thank you for subscribing. I really appreciate it. I'd say we, but it's just me tonight because this is a solo stream. Jack is not here to also thank. Jack abandoned us. We've been abandoned by Jack. All right. I'm gonna read what's on this note. Do a quiet. That? Oh, sh stop it! Who's that? Why do you say who's that and not turn around anyway? What kind of jerk? Jerk are you? I'm gonna read. He's not gonna keep me from reading that note. He's not. I'm just gonna do it even slower. Damn it! All right, we've read the note. <clears throat> Cedric. Please speak to Cook about last night's dinner. While technically the menu conformed to my instructions, I suspect that the lamb was somewhat older than the springs. And I am in no way fooled by his practice of warming the salad to disguise wilting. If Cook is incapable of finding adequate ingredients, he can be replaced. 
If he offers those same excuses about the stone market shortages, please remind him that the grocery budget is a good 50% above last year's figures. And even he should be able to procure adequate vic vic victual victuals at those prices. Lord Bafford. See, this is this is the kind of 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 detail I like about this game. This note right here is really just a note. It's 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 background information, it details. There's no there's no useful information in this. This is not like a hint to get money. This is just the game world being a rich, wonderful place. Now we're gonna move on. What's that? Hmm. Oh well. Mm -hmm. That is not very attentive. Shit, no. We're getting into the mansion proper now, goddammit. Alright. Anything worth stealing? Nope. Nope. Alright. Nothing worth stealing. Well, you can't have shooting, chat. This is sneaking. Hear noises. Someone's coming. We're going away. I say going away. We're gonna risk it. Walking out in the open. Oh. Someone heard something. Alright. What the fuck? Dr. Bep716! Thank you for subscribing. I really appreciate it. I don't see why I should have to be the one down here in the cold and the dark and the damp. This room's like an echo chamber. See that bread? I just ate that bread. I'm gonna eat all their food. No, it's because it's on expert, but I'm not gaining any health from that food either. It's, it's once again, it's more just details. This way, all right. Where did you go? Everybody, I make noises controlling the card. Everybody, everybody. love the money noises that ding it's great here a main entrance it's kind of cheating i know my way around this place but so what
hide under a box? I, I can't hide under a box in this. They don't have that option. Sorry. I can hide in the shadows. I can hide around this corner until this guard comes back. He's taking a sweet-ass time, motherfucker. There I go. What's going on over there? Ugh, God, I hate tiles. Seems peaceful enough now. Tile. Safe. Carpet. Back on the tile. A little tile there. I'll make noise and I'll alert him and... The guards will kill me. <clears throat> to all staff. Tell the sir we'll be taking his dinner and evening out tonight. So domestics and manservants have the night free. Housekeep is still expected to finish the quarters and the general polish. The house guard has not defined this as an opportunity to shirk and lapses will be brought up with the sir, Cedric. All right. Gold. Give me gold. I want more gold. Yeah. Got me a goblet, motherfucker. Motherfucking goblet. Oh, somebody heard that. Nope, nobody here. Nobody here. Probably just wasted that water arrow, but eh, big deal. Oh, the what the fuck? Um, wasn't there a what the fuck? Or am I hearing things? Oh god damn it! This chat scrolls too fast. Hold on one second. XLG81. Thank you for subscribing. We really appreciate it. All right. Back to game. Back to back to game and boring and quiet. All right. Except game start. Why not start game? The game crash. Game might have crashed. Game crashed. Don't crash game. Come back. No. Oh, son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! The game crashed! Oh, man! That blows! That fucking blows! You can't- Ah! I- I was trying to Iron Man it, so I didn't make any saves. Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! It was your fault, XL... whatever, 81? <laughs> I don't know! I had alt-tab, and once I, once I tried to go back to the program, it, it, it crashed. No! No! That was a fine run! That was a fine run! Oh, gah. Now I just feel awful. Now I just feel awful. All right. All right. Well, we're going to try something different because it took me a while to get back there and I'm not going to make everybody sit through that same stretch of level, but you did get a little taste of Thief the Dark Project. So now I gotta think about what I am going to do next.